Hello, and welcome to the Carter Mario Spotlight of the Month for August. I'm Courtney Parent, the Digital Marketing Associate for the firm. Normally, I'm the one behind the camera filming our spotlights, but this month, I'm excited to host it. August has been a busy month here at Carter Mario. WTNH News 8 visited our Milford office earlier this month with their host, Ryan Christopher, to film a segment with Carter on motorcycle safety. The focus was on what the driver can do as well as the passenger to remain safe while riding. Ryan clearly enjoyed the ride and the segment will be featured sometime during the month of September on WTNH's Connecticut Style. Another great event at the firm was a visit from Spartacus, the star of our Carter Cares Charity of the Month, Canine First Responders. Spartacus is one of a team of amazing dogs who help bring comfort to victims of disasters. If you've not seen our August Charity of the Month video featuring the canine first responders, please take a moment to watch it on our Facebook page. You'll see firsthand all the wonderful things Spartacus and his team are doing. Our deployments um, have been many, from Sandy Hook Elementary School to the murder at Jonathan Law High School, to the Boston Marathon bombing, to Metro North train derailment. What we provide is uh, a service that leverages from the mental health side with training and experience, the human dog connection to jumpstart the recovery process. Also, Spartacus just finished up a photo shoot with the Dosecki's most interesting man in the world. So I guess that makes Spartacus the most interesting dog. Congratulations to Spartacus and all the canine first responders for the great work they do. On a legal note, this month, attorney Jessica Ayala will speak about the fifth step in a trial, charging a jury. Good afternoon, everybody. I am attorney Jessica Ayala. I am one of the litigation attorneys here at Carter Mario. Uh, today, I get the opportunity to speak with you a little bit about presentation of the jury instructions to the jury. Uh, this happens at the end of trial right before deliberation. Up until this point, the jury hears the opening statements from the attorneys, all of the evidence, testimony from witnesses, whether they may be officers, the plaintiff, the defendant, uh, doctors potentially could testify in trial. Then the attorneys have their opportunity to give closing statements. And at that point, the judge will then give the jury instructions. Being attentive during the jury instructions is crucial. Jurors need to know the law when they go back into the deliberation room. They need to understand what issues that they are deciding, and it is at this time uh, during the jury instructions that the judge will tell them that. Anyway, thank you very much for your time. Uh, I look forward to speaking with you again soon. Have a great day. Let's give a special shout out to two of our employees for being August Employee of the Month and Case Manager of the Month. These folks were selected by their peers for going beyond the call of duty to help their fellow staff and our clients. Last, but perhaps the most exciting news of the month, is the addition of our newest Carter Mario employee, Casper. Casper stands for Carter's Accident Scene Personal Injury Robot. Casper's job is to give us a bird's eye view of what the intersections and roads actually look like where our client's accidents occurred. No longer will adjusters and juries have to look at photographs or sketches and try to imagine what the overall scene looked like. Everyone here at Carter Mario is excited to welcome Casper to the team. That is, except for Carter's dog, Romeo. That's it for this edition of the Carter Mario Spotlight of the Month for August. Enjoy the last few weeks of summer and we'll see you next month.